Hi all, welcome to my video. Today in this video, together we will model this ring. I will be using on the surface commands and let's see how we can do that. I will create a new part. And in the front plane, a sketch. Here, I put a polygon with the number of 12 edges. Here, simply select. Put that 12 and model this. Control press, select this point and select your origin and make them vertical. And then here I will give a diameter of 20. If you don't want to those, uh, use this alignment, you can use a line as well. So we close this, we select one plane, go to reference geometry plane and 2 mm offset. On this plane I create a sketch, I press my space, look normal to, and then I will pick one more time polygon and number again 12. And this time this will be horizontal. I press my control, select this point and this edge, we say coincidence. And then after, I will close this. So, in the front plane, let's do without front plane. I will create a point, but maybe we can do it without. So, surface load, right click selection manager, select this one. Selection manager, let's select only point. Is it allowed? Not seems. Can I do that? No. So, we need it. On the front plane, we create a sketch. I pick here a point and I drop on this point. You see now a point. So this plane can be hidden. We have this point, three other sketches, two other sketches. Lawful surface active. I select here sketch three, right click selection manager. I select this guy. And then I say OK. This is good. After I go to load surface again, right click, selection manager. Selection manager is used because if I select this one, all sketch will be selected. I don't want that. But here, just an edge, we can select it. So I create one more surface load. It looks good. So let's see what we got now. These objects and sketch two. What was sketch first? Sketch first was here. Okay. Select origin. Select font plane. Go to reference geometry and select an axis. We're gonna create copies. That's why this axis needed. Plane one here. And I select it. And I go to plane again. And 0 0.5. Offset. We have now second plane, select the sketch, this one, offset, reverse, 0 0.5, didn't work, maybe we need to convert, select, convert entities, select everything, offset, 0 0.5, and base geometry that we converted will be converted to air construction geometry so it doesn't have impact. Okay, something like this. We can close plane 2. We can close the sketch. I mean, that means hide. So then I go to loft again. This can be selected, but there is a sketch and number of objects there. So selection manager needed. Right click, selection manager. Select this guy. And let's see what happens. Yes, we get this one. Now, friends, fun begins. This is the nice part. X is selected. Control pressed. Select three of bodies here. And go to circular pattern. Okay, bodies did not arrive, but we select here. Twelve times they will be copied. And this is what we want. 
we can hide the sketch and big part of the operation is already complete so plane 2 needed now select them loft here convert sketch 4 the sketch plus sketch we created to create a chamfer and then we create here one circle okay circle will be 17.5 it is good sketch closed surface planner surface okay really nice and uh, we got a lot of surface bodies individual bodies we select all of them we go to mirror and if you do that they are automatically coming to mirror but seems they are not coming for circular pattern this is new to me but each time I go different ways of doing things I do not uh, see uh, foresee some of the operations so merge solids merge solids will not work but need surfaces need surfaces will combine all surfaces did not do doesn't harm us we are gonna do by ourselves okay I don't know why it didn't work everything here go to surfaces need surfaces select everything okay and then close it we got one surface body everything knitted this is what we wanted so extrude surface I will simply use again here a new surface I could use loft but in this case I wouldn't use because we cannot control rotation very good because there is no any control point so that's why I create here a sketch I convert this guy close my sketch extrude and to a point we can do like this now we get two surface last operation knit and we get one surface we forget one thing and create a solid from this body now surface converted to a solid body it is a real part now cut it you're gonna see nice fillet we select fillet symmetric fillet we're gonna select one edge here 0 0.5 here 1 so I create an asymmetrical filleting and for the second one we're gonna shift profile and we will add here this nice radius and if you look inside of rings in fact there is a big radius here not a big radius I have to say it is completely small not uh, mostly flat but uh, this is for a uh, demonstration that's not very uh, important now and uh, after this operation we completed our uh, modeling and it is ready and it is total different approach than conventional methods of cutting and uh, doing other way there might be another options also which is maybe better than this but uh, I hope you like it and if you do please hit the like button and make a comment thanks a lot